We're a little over a month away from the greatest spectacle in racing, and fans are already making plans on how they're getting to the track. News 8's Danielle Zakowski spoke to the team at the Speedway today. Danielle. IMS says that race day parking and camping lots are already sold out. The sellout happened three weeks earlier than last year. IMS President Doug Bowl says interest in IndyCar is growing, and it's because of the families sharing the sport with their kids. IMS President Doug Bowles says IndyCar continues to grow thanks to generational fans. Well, the Indy 500 is, is really celebrating its 108th running because of the generational aspect of it, the way it's passed down from parents to kids or from grandparents on down. It's, it's amazing. Bowles says they work to make the track and the month of May as family friendly as possible. Kids 15 or under get in for free on practice or qualifying days. And on race day, they can come for free if they sit in the general admission infield area. We allow you to bring your own cooler. So we don't force you to buy the concessions we have here, and we have them, and I'd love for you to buy them. But we really try and make it as easy and family friendly as we can for folks to come to our events. The parking sellout includes anything that IMS owns. Locals are still renting their homes, yards, and driveways for the race. Only about 40% of our customer can actually park on property that the Indianapolis Motor Speedway owns. So 60% of our folks that are coming actually park in the neighborhood. So they park there or we offer a shuttle service where you can park downtown or you can park at the airport and then that shuttle service brings you to the Speedway. Overall, IMS contributed a billion dollars to the Indiana economy last year. Increased interest will only increase this. When you're parking in the town of Speedway and you're parking in somebody's front yard, it's fun to talk to some of those people that own those homes. They save some of that money and it pays for kids' colleges. The official Bike to the 500 event is still open for registration. Fans will start at the AMP at 16 Tech and bike to the Speedway in two groups. There are parking and camping spots available for other days in May for anyone wanting to see other IndyCar events leading up to the race. I'm Danielle Zulkowski for Wish TV, wishtv.com, and follow us on Facebook for updates.